Hi, uh, this video is about um, H5P's uh, image slider feature, so let's get started. An image slider, uh, also known as image carousel or uh, image slideshow, is an interactive element that displays a series of images or visual content in a dynamic and engaging manner. It's commonly used on websites uh, or digital platforms to show multiple images or graphics uh, in a single space. This allows users to view different visuals by navigating the slider. You can also use this feature in your course whenever you need to show many images within limited space. Moreover, you can take this uh, feature beyond a simple image display and use it more creatively. For instance, uh, you can employ it uh, for before and after comparisons, educational tutorials, interactive maps, uh, product showcase, uh, historical timelines and more. In this tutorial, I'll show you my example. I want to share with course instructors how to set smart learning objectives. Instead of presenting plain text article, I want to enhance the engagement factor. So I have created a sequence of images, uh, each containing an abbreviation letter. So my images are ready and let's get into it. Okay, so what should we do is that we have to make sure that the edit mode is on. Then uh, I'll add activity or resource. Let's go to activities, H5P interaction. And here uh, I choose um, image slider then let's expand the screen and the title will be smart learning objectives okay so as a title i'll put the main page for example so as an image then i'll add the first page uh, you can first write the main info with hover text. I'll show it later on. How does it work? Next, we're gonna add item, and I'll just make it specific. and just proceed and save and save and display so now we have our slider next let's check the hover text as an example i'll put some text 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 Let's save and when I hover on the text you can see that it's written text text text. So if there is a additional information that you would like to share you can actually put it uh, in the hover text. The problem that I'm having right now with image slider is that it covers uh, most of the page and also um, in my opinion like what i'm doing right now is out of the context so i want to integrate this image slider into the article that i want to share with uh, professors about the smart learning objectives so what i'm gonna do is i'll go to uh, my page let's open this a new page i'll add an activity or resource and then i'm going to page and here it will be description I'll skip and then the information I'll just uh, copy and paste from what I've prepared. 
so base let's move it to center next um, I go to my image slider next I scroll down and try to find this part which is called embed I click on it and then I'll copy this I'll go to my edit page and uh, click on this HTML code and then put it here I'll change the dimensions uh, 500 to 600 for example and save and display so as you can see now it is visible and it has information here what is smart learning next i want to add the text after carousel so there will be some examples on how to make um, proper learning objectives so I go to settings, I click here, so as you can see whenever you update um, the image slider comes to its initial size meaning uh, taking half of more, more than half of the page so whenever you are making an update make sure that you enter the to the uh, HTML part and uh, adjust the sizing again otherwise yeah you may have um, problems with it so let's check it now so this is how it looks uh, yeah Moodle has its own uh, disadvantages for example I couldn't center the slider but yeah it is what it is and uh, below I added some text on the example of smart learning objectives so hope this video was useful and informative if so don't forget to hit the like button and uh, you can also share in the comments how would you use an image slider in your course uh, thanks for watching and uh, see you next time